Hello guys, welcome back to Raver's Mead. I have Bluey with me here for today's little video. Uh, so today is going to be Blue's first ride since his um, incident with his feet. Uh, back a few, a mm, couple of months ago now I think it was, uh, when he had a rodeo in the field and ripped both of his front shoes off along with rather a lot of the hoof. Um, if <laughs> I did do a bit of a video about that showing the state of his feet so if you want to check that out you can go and uh, have a look I'll put the link in the description or do one of those cards or something so you can find it um, but yeah this is gonna be his first ride since that incident now I've done a little bit of lunge work with him and a bit of ground work with him um, but today is the day that we're gonna see how comfortable he is with the extra weight of me on his feet as well uh, so i'm gonna adjust that noseband and then we're gonna head out into the field um, and go for a little ride and see how he is
boy bluey you need a bath now don't you okay so I've got mixed feelings about that to be honest I mean foot wise he feel, feels absolutely fine um, oh I'm just a bit disappointed about his mouthiness and his resistance like he just did not want to soften at all it's like he just set his jaw against me and that was that um, which was a bit disappointing but it is what it is you can't have perfect rides every time he has had a bit of time off I mean usually when they have a bit of time off they come back and they're quite soft and willing and supple but he's obviously just not feeling it today I guess um, yeah so it'd be interesting to watch the footage back of that to see how it looks and compared to how it felt I said it felt really heavy um, he felt very argumentative um, blue has a habit of like contorting his back and he twists himself and he manipulates his body and he really puts the rider in a horrible position um, it took us a while to figure it out we used to think that his saddle was slipping and things like that but actually it was him like tilting and twisting his back underneath us and he still does it not as bad now that we know what the issue is um, but he just he manipulates his body so well and he'll do literally anything in his power that he can to not go straight which makes it very difficult uh -huh. and yeah he was just dead set against me today but there you go like i said i'll um i'm intrigued to watch the footage back and see how he looked and compared to how he felt but there you go but yeah that was our first little ride back since blue's foot incident mixed feelings about it but he is a good boy aren't you and your feet are absolutely fine to do that a couple of times a week aren't they mate I think a couple of schooling sessions a week and then you can do a couple of days of lunging in between with that nice piece of elastic around your bottom aren't you yes anyway he's getting all itchy so i'm gonna get him bathed up and put back out in the field um and yeah thanks for hanging out with me today guys and i'll see you in our next video